There are some jobs only a lineman can do, and in April, Delaware Electric Cooperative crews were given the task of providing safe nesting for ospreys at Prime Hook National Wildlife Refuge in Milton. Hot Bucket crew chief Philip Collison and his team were up to the challenge. They unstrapped a donated co-op utility pole from their trailer and started work on the artificial nest, which will help replace the osprey's natural wooded habitat, which is slowly disappearing. We're making up for a deficit of uh, suitable habitat, suitable nesting areas for osprey. Crews first had to dig a hole deep enough to support the 20-foot pole. Next, the nesting platform had to be attached to the pole, which will eventually house a nest and osprey eggs. Co-op crews then carefully lifted the utility pole into the air and trimmed off some of the wood. After the chainsaw was put away, the pole was guided into the hole. Refuge officials hope ospreys will notice the nest quickly and make it their home. Uh, we're hoping to get a nest here uh, this season. It's still um, early in the uh, breeding season, so we're optimistic that we could get one there. The refuge may be in luck. Within minutes of the pole's placement, curious ospreys were already flying over the nest. The birds weren't seen at Prime Hook until 1992, and refuge officials say the co-op's efforts will make sure the birds remain in the first state. Yeah, the co-op has helped us a lot throughout the years. Um, we, they helped us put uh, several of these uh, osprey platforms up in the past, and uh, we look forward to the future and the support that, that the co-op gives. Helping wildlife and helping the community. Just one more way your co-op makes a difference every day. I'm Jeremy Tucker for Delaware Electric Cooperative.